Welcome to the story time. My name is Keiko Satomi. I am the children's librarian at the Kuroke Public Library. So today we have a couple guests. What are they? Yes, they are dinosaurs. We are going to do story time about dinosaurs. Enjoy some stories and songs and a little movement today. Okay, so let's start with hello song as usual. So we are going to use a couple American Sign Language for this song. And does anybody remember how to say hello in sign language? That's right. So you put one hand on your forehead, move it away from your forehead. So this is hello. Other sign is friend. To say friends, yes, some of you already know, using uh, two pointers, here's one friend, here's another friend, they give each other hug. So this is friend. And the hello song goes like this. Hello friends, hello friends, hello friends. Time to say hello. Good job. So today I have a couple of friends who want to say hello to you too. So who comes first? Ooh, 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 can you guess? Who is this? You are right. This is a cat and his name is Pete. Pete the cat. And what does cat say? That's right, cat says meow, meow, and the song goes like this. When cat gets up in the morning, he always says hello. When cat gets up in the morning, he always says hello. And what does he say? Meow, meow, meow. And that is what he says. Okay, bye-bye, Pete. So next friend is, let's see, oh, do you want to say hello to my friends? Do, 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 do. What is this? Yes, thank you for wearing a mask. Yes, this is a T-Rex. And do you know what does T-Rex say? Yep, can you make the sound? <laughs> All right, are you ready? When T-Rex gets up in the morning, he always says hello. When T-Rex gets up in the morning, he always says hello. And what does he say? <laughs> and that is what he says. Okay, thank you T-Rex for saying hello to my friends. Okay. So let's move on to today's first story. So uh, the title of the story is How Do Dinosaurs Choose Their Pets? Hmm, have you ever thought of dinosaurs want some pets just like us? This is written by Jane, Jane Yoren and Mark Teague. How does a dinosaur pick out his pet? Does he go on the floor with a stick and a net? Does he head to the zoo and take home a big cat? And what does his mom have to say about that? Does she drag a huge elephant back in the wagon with both its long trunk and its wee tail are dragging? Or, speaking of dragons, does she go acquire a high-flying beastie who loves to breathe 
fire. Does he pick out a ball constrictor for play? Does it look at his dog in a very odd way? Does he sneak an iguana inside of a cap? Or lead home a kangaroo by a long strap? Does he ask for a manatee, maybe a whale, or wish for a shark he can keep in a pail? Does she carry off ta uh, turtles, zebras, and mink, giving them hay and a cola to, to drink? Is that what you think? No. A dinosaur doesn't. She knows what to do, and she never brings anything home from the zoo. He goes to a shelter or pet store or farm. To find a small creature who will do no harm. He brings home a kitten or hamster or pup that he can teach manners as they both grow up. She cares for her pet and gives love even more. Big hugs to your friend, little dinosaur. Okay, good listening friends, my friends. So let's do a little bit of movement. So we are going to do, put your hands up high, down low, and in the middle. And next, put your elbows in the front and the back and on the side. And then what do we do? We are going to go. Ready for the song? Put your hands up high, put your hands down low, put your hands in the middle and wiggle just so. Put your elbows in the front, put your elbows in the back, put your elbows on the side and crack, crack, crack. <laughs> Good job. Let's do one more time. Put your hands up high, put your hands down low, put your hands in the middle and the wiggle just so, put your elbows in the front, put your elbows in the back, put your elbows on the side and crack, crack, crack. Okay, so the next song is Twinkle Twinkle Dinosaur. So as you guess, this is the same tune as Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, but our lyric is a little bit different. So let's see how it goes. So you ready? Twinkle Twinkle Dinosaur, letting out a great big roar. Banky is it jump, jump, jump. Banky walks it stump, stump, stump. Twinkle, twinkle, dinosaurs, letting out a great big roar. Okay, so next, here comes a giant, enormous dinosaur. So let's pretend we are a big, giant dinosaur. Are you ready? Twinkle, twinkle, dinosaurs, letting out a great big roar. When he is it, jump, jump, jump. When he walks, it stomp, stomp, stomp. Twinkle, twinkle, dinosaurs, letting out a great big roar. Are you a great big dinosaur? So the next is, here come 
it's a teeny tiny baby dinosaur. So let's see how it goes. Are you ready? Twinkle, twinkle, dinosaur, letting out a baby roar. When he is it jumps, jumps, jumps. When he walks it stumps, stumps, stumps. Twinkle, twinkle, dinosaur, letting out a baby roar. <laughs> Great job. Okay, so let's see what's on the blue board. What do you see on the board? Let me scoot this over a little bit. Okay. Yes, do you see some dinosaurs? And how many dinosaurs do you see? Can we count? Okay. One. Two, three, four, and five. Five dinosaurs jumping on the bed. And then let's see what is going to happen. Okay. Five little dinosaurs jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. And Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more dinosaurs jumping on the bed. How many left? Shall we count? One, two, three, and four. Four little dinosaurs jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. And the mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more dinosaurs jumping on the bed. Let's count how many left. One, two, and three. Three little dinosaurs jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. And Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more dinosaurs jumping on the bed. Let's see. One and two. Two little dinosaurs jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. And Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more dinosaurs jumping on the bed. One last dinosaurs. One last dinosaur jumping on the bed. He fell off and bumped his head. And Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more dinosaurs jumping on the bed. All done. So please, my friends, don't jump on your bed, okay? Okay. Open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap, lap, lap. Okay, so today's last story is this. I'm a hungry dinosaur. This is written by Janine Bryan and Anne James. I'm a hungry dinosaur with a hungry tongue. I shake and stir and mix and beat and make a cake that's yum. Shake, shake, stir, stir, make a cake that's yum. I'm a hungry dinosaur with cake mix for the pun. I tip it in and pat it down and smooth it best I can. Tip, tip, pat, pat and smooth it best I can. I'm a hungry dinosaur. I'm hungry for some cake. 
and you slide it in the oven now and sit and watch it bake. Slide, slide, sit, sit, sit and watch it bake. I'm a hungry dinosaur. Hmm, the lovely smell. I iced the top and slipped and slopped and sprinkled it as well. Slip, slip, slop, slop, and sprinkle it as well. I'm a hungry dinosaur. Oh, the cake looks nice. I chomp and chew a piece or two, maybe one more slice. Chomp, chomp, chew, chew, maybe one more slice. I'm a hungry dinosaur. I really love to bake. I think I grab my bowl and a spoon and make another cake. Mix, mix, beat, beat, make another cake. Beat. So now you can go grab a scarf or a piece of cloth, a kitchen paper would work. We are going to move on to scarf sound. Okay. Are you ready? So we are going to do a peekaboo sound as usual. Peekaboo, peekaboo, I see you. I see you, I see your little nose, I see your tiny toes, I see you, I see you. Okay, let's do one more time. Peekaboo, peekaboo, I see you, I see you. I see your little nose, I see your tiny toes, I see you, I see you. Okay, good job. So today's hinare is a popcorn kernels. Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels, in the pot, in the pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them. Shake and shake them till they pop. Till they pop. Okay, so one last time. Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in the pot, in the pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them till they pop. Till they pop. Okay, so thank you so much for sharing your time this morning. And we are singing. We are going to sing a goodbye song with dinosaurs. You ready? Now it's time to say goodbye. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Now it's time to say goodbye and see you all next. Time. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great rest of the week.